Uh, I just spoke with Speaker McCarthy, and we've reached a bipartisan budget agreement that we're ready to move to the full Congress. And I think it's a really important step forward, excuse me. <clears throat> and it takes uh, the threat of catastrophic default off the table, protects our hard-earned and historic economic recovery. And the agreement also represents a compromise, which means no one got everything they want. But that's the responsibility of governing. And the, this is a deal is good news, for, I believe, you'll see, for the American people. The agreement prevents the worst possible crisis, a default for the first time in our nation's history. An economic recession, retirement accounts devastated, millions of jobs lost. It also protects key priorities and accomplishments and values that congressional Democrats and I have fought long for, long and hard for. Investing in America's agenda that's creating good jobs and communities throughout the country. It protects Social Security, Medicare, and veterans, and so much more. The Speaker and I made it clear from the start that the only way forward was a bipartisan agreement. That agreement now goes to the United States House and to the Senate. I strongly urge both, both chambers to pass that agreement. Let's keep moving forward on meeting our obligations and building the strongest economy in the history of the world. I'll take a few questions.